main objective of the Community Ambassadors program is to empower young people to make a difference within their local area. We're a housing association. Um, we have well, we have over 57,000 homes across England. Um, we have a high concentration in this particular area. We've got a big focus on young people um, because what we've identified is that a, a large majority of our residents are young people. And I mean, what's refreshing for me is you always will find a small group of people that want to make a difference and it's by targeting them that you can help things manifest and grow into, into things like our Community Ambassadors Programme. Well, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because if we, it, would, it would be actually great to have them. No, I'm not sure yet, I'll ask them. I think music and art are. Yeah, but that's what I mean, like... Our aim is to like, bring the communities together. We started by pointing out what we thought were problems in the community and a big thing that came up was that division between the older generation and the younger generation. So then we um, did some questionnaires to find out what the community thought would be a good way to bring like, all types of like, cultures, generations together. And a lot of people thought like a event would be best for that. In the process of organising a, a community event uh, to get all of the age ranges congregated. We are hopeful of a, a, a very high percentage of people to attend. The good thing that it's that young people organising this rather than older people because they can be able to see that there are some good young people out there. Once they see that we can make something productive, like make the event happen and everything, and we have brought young people and older people together in an event that that can sort of close the gap between our generations and I think it can open new views of how young people can be. I'm going to go over this one more time so we all know and don't forget. Um, My name's Ali and I'm the facilitator on the project. The main thing for me is to allow them to take control um, of the project. Um, it, it is, it's for them, uh, by them, you know, it's them delivering to the community. It's also just understanding the other side. Um, you know, you've got your perspective as a young person, okay, but how does it look from the other side? You know, how do the police view young people? How do they view communities? So it's given them a, an insight and I think it's kind of mending certain broken relationships or building relationships that perhaps weren't there in the first place. And it's been able to understand the dynamics of community life uh, and everybody, all the you know, the people that are involved in it. From this, I've learned to like look at things from different perspectives to know how we should kind of tackle an event and it's kind of helped in my education as well. It's not just a case of the safer neighbourhoods teams that are largely adult people, it is the whole community and the voice and getting a wide range of views and not just this minority making decisions for the majority. We've got a voice as well. Information tonight because if it's a tripes farm... It's going to I know my time is a, is a very trusted provider. So when it came to running the Community Ambassadors Program, they were one of the first people that we approached. I think it's imperative that we work together. I think it's a must because, yeah, we're a social landlord. So at the end of the day, if you're looking at it from the cynical point of view, we collect rent and we provide accommodation. Um, we're not specialists in social work. We're not specialists in youth work. So to have a provider that can deliver that um, is very very important. Young people are capable of doing so much more than perhaps they're given credit for. I think the maturity in the group is absolutely fantastic. A good way to get young people more involved in improving the aspects of their community. Yeah, it's just really enjoyable and I can't wait to do the next one. <laughs> this is my last so I got to aim high never giving up on anything so I got to try but it ain't me. I ain't even gonna lie I refuse to watch my life just pass me by Don't follow the crowd, be a trendsetter Don't sit around, be a go-getter Cause it's true, life is what you make it So you gotta keep it real, no